Hi guys, I'm going to head to Yevon now. Let's skip all the cutscenes. Okay, we made it here to Yavin. Well, not Yavin itself because, well, it's a gas giant, so it's not like we can land on it. But, we still, um, there's still a kind of like a space station type dealio going on, so. Let's see if there's anything we can do. What? Level up mission. Good enough. Uh, what should we give her? Sure. Exit. Alright. Now let's continue. Mm -hmm. Yep. Go through all these access panel hatches. And we should be good! Come on, go. There we go. Hey. Who's that? What do you want? I recognize your ship, Davix, isn't it? Who are you? Are you new or something? Yeah, I'm new. It's not like a trend. A trend ocean? And you're not one of Davix. Who are you? What do you want? And since they haven't been here 50 years, not since the last war, don't see why they'd start making it happen right now. Still, all my business with the Sith so long as politics ain't my affairs, so as long as you don't get all worked up, I guess I can let you in. It'd be nice to have someone to talk to for a change. Trando Shan just follows not exactly so many conversation lists. Yeah, yeah, it'll get antsy, I'll get there. Just have to fill around that lock, yeah, yeah. Stupid lock. Ah, there we go. Alright. <laughs> Too human. I don't see many of your kind here and here at all. Not since the war anyway. What brings you here? You can still tell me you're a Jedi. You should not look it. And they're only old. Darth <laughs> Malik never heard of them. Never heard of him. Or is a new Sith Lord who's been in the Republic such a hard time? No, I haven't been keeping up on recent events. Oh, well, you see, I'm kind of out of touch with the rest of the galaxy. I haven't left this system almost 50 years in this station. In the last five, so... Hey, it's not a bad way to live. I have all the gadgets I need to take with, smugglers and trash, and food and interesting pieces of equipment. Mm -hmm. The station is an old probe supply depot from when they were fighting Exer Kuhn. Once they destroyed the Yavin Forest surface, so they didn't need it anymore. Once they'd gone, I decided to move in and use the place myself. It's not very roomy, but I think it turned out alright. It's close to the Evan 4 where I get most of my parts. No one comes here except the smugglers and trash hands anyway, so I get left alone the way I like it. I've never heard of Morads. There are plenty of artifacts in the before, but no forges or whatever. That's all you're interested in. You probably want to try another system. Yeah, we know the system. Let's see what he has. We have a few things kicking around the place. Stuff Travis and Smugglers have brought me a look at, and a few things I've been making parts. They're cheap though. They peel off for what I can make, and sell exactly. Or, Anything I sell to you, I can't exactly sell to them, no, can I? But if you're willing to pay, I've got a, a few of our, my more advanced things you can look at. I'm always working on them more, so you can check back some other time if you're right now. Hmm. 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 Ooh, that looks like really good armor. But it's 10,000 credits. That'd be like half of my credit score. Credit score. Yeah, I have the credit score in this game. Okay, it's 720. Anyways. Um. Use axe. Leave it alone. <laughs> Alright. There are these access panels here. They don't go anywhere. At least not right now. Anyways, I don't think there's any way you can get by them. Access denied! So yeah, that dude has some interesting stuff to sell, but ugh, I don't know if I'd be interested in it. Like, really, it's pretty expensive. 
Hey, dude, where do you? Oh, he's hanging around here. There he is. <laughs> yeah, no, so that's why I was brought them in for this game. <laughs> Good thing trying to get them all though. This seems pretty like Zack. You see me around to squish them. Aww. I am really not sure if I should buy any of this stuff. Implants, I really don't have any. All I would be getting would be the armor. Hmm. It's upgradable. You know what? I'm gonna do it. Ah ha ha. Maybe a mission can bite. But it is upgradable. I'll have to upgrade it when I'm back on the ship. What? So let's go. Gotta get back. Anyways, I hope this uh, game's almost done. I mean, like, not that I've not enjoyed playing it or anything, but geez, it's been going on like, I don't know, it must be going on for like. I, it might be going on for more than 150 parts. I mean, like, seriously. I guess that's not too much considering this game is an RPG, but. Anyways. And it's not like I'm rushing through any of the conversations, really. Okay. Now that we checked out the Avon 4, let's head to the Starfart system. You are strong, child. But I will break you. I'll never fall to the dark side. You think torture will turn me, Malak? You are a fool. Torture? No, dear Bastula. You misunderstand. This is but a taste of the dark side to whet your appetite. When you finally swear loyalty to me, it will be willingly. Never. <laughs> Such resolve in your words, but I see the truth in your heart. The dark side calls to you, Bastula. You hunger to taste it. Become my apprentice, and all its power can be yours. Transmitting these coordinates to Admiral Dodonna. Maybe a quick strike by the Republic can cripple the Sith fleet. Message is away. Now we can just wait for the Republic to show up. We should be safe here. We're outside their sensor range. Small vanguard of Sith fighters coming in hard. Someone needs to get on those gun turrets. Take those fighters out before they report our position to the main fleet.
Oh, we've got problems. We've flown in some kind of disruptor field. All my instruments are jammed. We've got massive overloads in all systems. I'm picking up a single planet in this system. I'll try and put us down there. Hold on. This may be a rough landing. 